Okay, recordings. I get asked this all the time. Can I submit recordings to the court? Or I've got some amazing recordings the court really needs to see, but they're not interested. What do you do? Okay, first of all, it can be tricky. I've very rarely seen recordings used in court. The court almost never will listen to audio recordings or view video recordings. For the simple reason is they don't have the equipment to do so. Uh, Yet yeah, you could probably say I'm going to take my phone along or I can take along a uh, dictaphone if you're a dinosaur like me. But that doesn't mean the court's going to admit it. You need the court's permission to submit recordings or even transcripts of a recording. It's always worth making transcripts. If you do want to submit a recording and you want the court's permission, you need to complete a C2 form if it's for child matters or a D11 form if it's finances. Uh, it is possible to attach transcripts of recordings as a piece of evidence on a witness statement. It needs to be a properly drafted witness statement. Otherwise, it's more likely to be thrown out and you're going to get told off. So, yeah, that's, that's it with recordings. They're tricky. It very rarely happens. In all the years that I've worked in family law, 17 so far, I can't think of a single case where it happens, but I'm sure it does. I hope this helps.